Hello guys, this is Joyce from J Scrapbook 2. Today I'm going to be coloring this image with some colored pencils. Um, this is a greeting farm image. Uh, it's a digital image and it comes in a set of five. And I'm going to be coloring this uh, little cute little witch. And I'm going, I'm going to be using Intense Pencils and this new colored pencils that I got. Um, it, which is called Fantasia. I actually bought it for my daughter because um, she wanted colored pencils that was in a tin rather than her um, Crayolas. But um, I'm trying it out today um, using um, Gamsel and uh, paper stumps. And I chose out some colors. Um, let's get started. So I'm using this uh, flesh tone for her face. And um, I haven't tried this out yet with the Gamsol or um, I haven't tried out these pencils at all. So I'm trying to see how it works. Um, so, um, I'm, see I love to buy um, digital images and I like to cut them all out and have it in a container and color whenever um, I feel like just coloring. In here, um, I put the um, Gamsel in this little container with the little foam, and I can just refill it or change the foam whenever I want. And um, I'm showing you that I have um, designated um, colors for all the stumps. And here I am trying to blend out the um, skin tone. Um, I don't realize that the Gamsel in the container is a little dry. I will be refilling it a um, little bit later on and uh, I'm still trying to um, do the skin tone with this. I'm realizing that it's not blending as um, well as I thought it would because uh, I'm used to blend using um, Prismacolors which blends really well but I do have um, several other brands of watercolor um, color pencils that um, I haven't tried out yet. Because um, I keep sticking to the same um, Prismacolor and Inktense, which are two of my favorite um, color pencils. So I'm using two shades of brown for her hair. Um, dark brown and the light brown. And here I am, this is um, the light brown I'm trying to blend out. And I'm realizing that it's not blending as well as I thought it would. Um, like I said before. So it's taking me a while to blend the colors um, together. So I put in some dark colors where um, I think the shade is going to be. See here, I'm flipping it over think, um, because I don't think there's enough Gamsel on the sponge. Um, so I'm still trying to uh, blend the two colors together. So I I'm speeding this up um, quite a bit, I, like four times, because it took a while for me to um, blend the colors. Even though this is such a um, small image, it took a while. So I'm putting in more dark colors and trying to um, give it like a more of a shady look. I mean, um, for the hair. Um, to give it more definition. Um, I think this pencil is, um, I paid about $25 for it, but um, I'm not sure um, if it's worth it. I would, I mean, it kind of works kind of like Crayola pencils, um, maybe even um, not as well as that. Uh, this right here is Intense Pencils, and I love these um, pencils. Their colors, the colors are very vibrant, and it has a lot of pigment in it. And so um, you can achieve that um, dark color with just a um, little bit of color. So finally, I'm um, using the um, Gamsel to blend out my Intense. And I'm realizing that um, the container of uh, OMS is dry. So here I refilled it a little bit. So now it's a lot more juicier and the colors are moving a lot faster and better. So this color that I'm using here for her hat is um, 
Violet from the um, Inktense brand and um, putting in more colors for the um, edges and um, to give more like definition. I think with a good brand of color pencils and Gamsol, you it's um, you'll get your um, you can get really good um, colored images, um, almost like a marker, um, like Copics or something. Um, so um, here I am using the same color for her dress, violet. And um, you can see it blends a lot faster with the Intense um, brand. I don't know, maybe I gotta retry the um, Fantasia brand because maybe it was the Gamsol um, that was dried and I didn't have enough on my stump. But um, so this is my coloring, and I'm just um, outlining the edges with the black Intense pencil at this point to give more um, shade and dimension to the um, image. So I um, hope you like this coloring tutorial and um, maybe um, you can try out uh, the color pencils that you have with um, Gamsol and see how that works out for you. So I'm adding a little bit more black and I'll be adding a little bit more dark brown to her hair because I feel that it is very light. Um, so thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you next time. Thanks so much. Bye.